Hardcore Iron Man Limited to PvP Worlds, we are getting closer to reaching our end goal of achieving an Inferno Cape, and the bounty for killing my Hardcore Iron Man have for the last month been 1 billion GP. Before we begin, as you all know, the boss high scores is now out. This means scouting my account is much, much easier. And for this reason, I will be jumping between content and bosses much more frequently. I'm not sure if it will annoy you guys, but it will definitely annoy the way I play the game. The first thing we are going to do is Winter Todd in hopes of getting some burnt pages. Not a single page. Nothing. 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 72. Fire making. Nothing. 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 73. Fire making. Five more crates. Not a single burnt page. Never lucky. If this disconnection updates my boss high score, I'm gonna be very, very upset, Jagex. Very upset. <gasps> I'm not saying this man is a scout, but he logged in a few minutes after I disconnected. Alright, it's time for me to move on to the next boss, Barrels. And from chest number 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12, we get nothing. Hello, Jagex. Hmm, hmm, I don't really want that item, but thank you. One of the most expensive items in the game, 1.8 mil. I have mentioned this in my past four videos, but the only item I'm currently going for is the Aram's Robe Skirt, currently 897 kill count. I did complete four more battle chests so I could get a clean 900 kill count. Sadly, I got nothing. The next place I'm going to, Draconic Visage, I would really like to get myself a skeletal wyvern drop, but the likelihood of me getting one, very slim. A rune? Kite shield. Playing this account gets me very paranoid from time to time, and for some reason every time I come to the Skeletal Wyverns, I'm afraid that someone is going to log in under me and just claw me out before I have any before I have any time to react because I'm usually AFK when I'm here at Skeletal Wyverns. We made a total of 790k from one trip, which was 63 kills. I don't get these too often, but when I do, I do appreciate them. 160k, high elk. The second trip done, we managed to get ourselves 1 mil and 56k from 6 to 1 kills. Step out, I want 1 bill. Let's go up. Oh, he was prepared! Oh my god. Right, we are moving on. Two Lizard and Shamans for the Dragon Warhammer. Let's be honest, I'm never getting it. Oh, the wrong Warhammer. First trip down, we got 105k. Oh, another Warhammer. From the second trip, we made 127k. I got myself a hard clue scroll from the Lizman Shaman, and I need an Addy Square Shield and a Blue Dehyde Vamps to complete it. And now, we got the Addy Square Shield. Who is this guy? I got a kill! According to Runelight, he had 10k. There it is, finally! These blue d eyed vamps have locked me so much from doing clue scrolls. I finally, finally got them. And that is step 3, completed. And we got ourselves a casket. I haven't been lucky with the chest at all, but I'm hoping for some d eyed boots. Nothing. As you can see here on Crystal Math Labs, there's someone who's consistently checking my XP gains every single hour, but they still haven't found me. Something great about these long bones, 4.5k experience per bone, 79 defense, and 99 combat. One more to go until the big 100. And from my weekly tiers of good X, I managed to get myself two runecrafting levels. That's a hot runecrafting level. And I'm back to the skeletal wyverns. Oh shit, shit, someone's here. Don't shit yourself, it's just your boy. <laughs> oh my god, I panicked, man. From trip number three at Skeletal Wyverns, 713k. Uh. I just spent almost one mil on 16,000 broad arrowheads. Let's now make 16,000 broad arrows. 69 fletching, the sex number. 70 fletching, 71 fletching. We can now do Dragonstone tipped runite bolts. We can go PKing with range. It's gonna hurt for some people to see this. Oh. And I am back to the Lisman Shamans. Another trip, 148k. Oh, look at that, I got a clue scroll. Oh my god, I got a clue scroll. Step one, completed. Step two, completed. Step number three, completed. Step number four, 
Aww. Step number five, and we got a casket. We got a beautiful casket. Go on, open it up. Here we go in three, two, one. Oh my god. Nice. I got another casket, a beginner one. For absolutely nothing. We got an easy casket. Let's open it in three, two, one. I'm gonna kill one mole just to mess with people's heads if they are hunting me. 95 range and we get nothing. It's about to happen. Bam, bam, bam. Daily disconnection completed. Gridlocked! Oh my god. I accidentally leaked my word to frame stream and straight away someone logged in. I'm jumping around so much in this episode. Now we're actually going to tan our green dragon heads. I have like 400 in my bank from earlier. And we're gonna make some green vampies and eventually high alt them for cash. Now we have 461 green leathers. That should give us a few, <laughs> a few crafting levels. <coughs> oh my god, I've been sick ever since I came back from Thailand. 59 crafting. Here we go, 60 crafting. We can now craft green dragon hide chaps. Oh my god, no matter where I go, I keep getting scouted. I think they have been waiting for me to get back home from Thailand. Oh, hello. A uh, clue scroll, can we do it? Step one, completed. Step number two, completed. Step three, <laughs> completed. Step number four, completed. Step number five, completed. And we got our beautiful casket. <laughs> Let's go. Good luck to me in three, two, one. Holy shit, this is even worse. I'm so sick of jumping around between content and I bet you guys are too, so I'll take a step back and stick to doing Slayer for a bit. Oh! We got it! Oh my god! I've been waiting so long to get this dragon spear! I'm so happy! Wait a minute. The drop rate of a dragon spear is 1 in 21,000. I could have gotten a draconic visage. There we go, task completed. Alright, the next task, Dagonaut. And that's the task completed. Alright, we got ourselves a medium casket, but first our next task is going to be Dust Devils. Probably my favorite task. Alright, good luck to me, 3, 2, 1. Armadillo page, I need all pages I can get. Is this a unique though? Is this a unique? No, it's not. I'll try to do this task really quickly by barraging them here in the catacombs in multi. So if a team comes, I'm dead. And there we have it. Task completed. This took me only 30 minutes, which is a lot of time saved. What the fuck is going on here? Is this a bot or is it John? Oh, that's the task completed. Next task, blood bells. All right, this is going to be the one. 80 defense. We're gonna now start training attack and get ourselves 70 attack. Missed the level, 62 attack. Another task completed. The next task is going to be call fights. Another task completed. And the next task is going to be fire giants. 63 attack. 64 attack. Oh yeah, and by the way, we have officially reached 3 digit combat level, 100 combat. This is a huge achievement for the account. And the fire giant task completed. Weekly tears of good eggs for two runecrafting levels. There we go. 65 attack coming in. And that's another task completed. 66 attack. Another task completed. Aberrant Spectres, very beautiful. The first superior of the video. We get nothing. 78 Slayer. Here we go, another superior. Give it to me, baby. Uh huh, uh huh. Nothing. There it is. 67 attack. 101 combat. Soon mains will be able to attack me. Scary. Task completed. Finally. Alright, Jagex, give me something easy. Give me something good. Dust doubles. Beautiful. 68 attack. Two more levels to go. Here it is, the Shoke Devil. I must say I love Dust Devils. Look at all the runes, the supplies, the coins I'm making. Give it to me, baby. Uh-huh. Black the yeah, vamps. And that's the task completed. Yeah, we made like 400k. Call fight task completed. We got 90 points. Blood Vells, please. Black dragons, even better. Last time I was here, I was very lucky and got a 1 in 20k item, the dragon spear. This time, we got nothing. Task completed. Greater demons. I don't know if you have noticed, but Jagex have decided to buff this account. We can now only attack people 10 combats higher and lower than me. Previously, it was 15. Clue scroll, hello. And I can do it. 69 attack, the sixth number. There we go, that's the task 
completed finally. Oh, and we got that rune full helm on the final kill. Hellhounds. But first, we're gonna do this clue scroll. Step one, completed. Two, completed. Three, completed. Step four, completed. Step five, completed. And we got the casket. Beautiful. Three, two, one. Thieving bag. With this thieving bag, I am going to scam all of you guys by forcing you to like this video and subscribe right now. All right, is this page unique? This is not a unique page. 70 attack, this is what we have been waiting for. We gained one combat level as well. But now we can use the Abyssal Whip, Sarah Sword. We can use everything we want to in the game. So the buff Jagex gave me earlier, they nerfed it. It's back to 15 combats above and below. And that should be task completed. <coughs> Sorry, I have Corona. Let's get another task. And that is the task completed. Fire Giants completed. Chorus task completed. We made 4.5 mil. And there it is. Another task completed. This took way too long. Ooh, task completed. 47 points more until we can buy ourselves the herb sack. Task completed. We now have 775 points. We can now buy ourselves the herb pack. We can get ourselves a sack of weed. Let's go. Rewards. Buy. Herb sack, buy one. We got it, boys. We got it. All right, so it wasn't the most content-filled episode, but we did get ourselves 70 attack. We got ourselves 80 defense and 102 combat. A dragon spear had been obtained. The herb sack had been obtained. And the thieving sack had been obtained. And we now have a cash stack of 2.3 mils. So we are very prepared for the next episode to do more bossing. Hope you guys enjoyed.